guys so fresh out of the shower this is what my hair looks like and today the only products I'm gonna be using in my hair is the only product at that I'm going to be using this eco styler gel with olive oil shea butter black castor oil and flax seeds um I paid $3.49 for this very small container and I paid $4.99 for this big container of the one with black castor oil and flax seed but I'm gonna use this one today and I'm guessing because it has all this extra stuff in it why they are selling it for that much but we'll see if it is worth the hype right now right off the bat though it smells really good it has like a yellow tint so this is all i'm gonna be using in my hair I got these really nice, really stretchy um, scrunchies at the beauty supply store just now. I paid like a dollar for six of them and oh my gosh, I'm sure you guys are able to see like how far it stretches. Ugh, so glad I bought them. So I'm going to brush around here now. And I'm doing my hair the very same way I do it when I'm using my regular day-to-day -day products. Put some more. It's not very thick, it's like regular, I guess it's like regular styling gel consistency. And I'm literally using like small dabs smells really good for one I kind of like when my styling gel is on the thicker side just because I don't feel like I have the thinnest hair and um <laughs> I'm just a year natural but I still have some shorter pieces here and there I'm gonna get my bandana because I don't have my satin scarf so I'm gonna use my bandana or better yet my handkerchief I was gonna buy a satin scarf just now but I just changed my mind because I already have one I just don't have it here now I'm doing my hair the very same way I do it on a regular even though this is like a newer product or whatever repping my country always so um, I'm gonna tie it down and normally when I don't have my satin scarf on hand I use this so Okay. No, I'm going to put some on my ends just because I don't want them to be just dry and out normally i'd put like my talia wad um leave-in conditioner before i like come out of the shower and stuff but i wanted to just use this 
So it claims to shines, holds, moisturizes, nourishes, repairs, promotes hair growth, no flake, no tack, anti-itch. So we're gonna see. So I'm gonna put, I need my tiny comb, hold on. I'm gonna just put some on my ends, especially because I literally just um, bleached them. And the last thing I need is for them to just be left out in the atmosphere like that. I normally have like something that moisturizes and nourishes them. And they said this does just that. So let's see. I'm gonna just put a little bit here and there. And I'm brushing through to like work the product into my hair. Probably should have like wet it up a little bit before, but This is supposed to be moisturizing, so. So, I'm gonna like So far it seems like product is everywhere So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna leave this to dry down and then I'm gonna come back and like show you guys what it looks like. If you got this far, you successfully made it to the end of this video. See, it wasn't that bad after all. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy the video, give it a thumbs up just because it's free. And of course, click here for more videos. Click here if you want to see my most recent video. And click here to subscribe. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video.